Game of Thrones fans rejoice. Yes, HBO's flagship massive, massive property is coming to a close. However, it would appear, thanks to the man himself, George R. R. Martin, that it will be continuing, or at least in some form or another. Now, we've known about spin-offs and prequels and sequels and all of these things for some time. There were some reports recently to indicate that they weren't happening, but now George R. R. Martin, the creator of Game of Thrones, I guess you could say, obviously he wrote the books, a Song of Fire and Ice, and he has now come out and stated on his blog, oh, and speaking of television, don't believe everything you read. Internet reports are notoriously unreliable. We've had five different Game of Thrones successor shows in development. I mislike the term spin-offs at HBO, and three of them are still moving forward nicely. The one I am not supposed to call The Long Night will be shooting later this year, and two other shows remain in the script stage, but are edging closer. What are they about? I cannot say, but maybe some of you should pick up a copy of Fire and Blood and come up with your own theories. So there you go. It would appear that three shows are currently you know, chugging along. Uh, the one that he's not supposed to call The Long Night is obviously this rumoured, or at least kind of confirmed anyway, a prequel story that's set way in the past, uh, the past of Westeros. So, you know, it's interesting that HBO don't have anything currently to replace, you know, such a massive property as Game of Thrones. They've got Watchmen coming soon, uh, and then also His Dark Materials, which is the Philip Pullman book adaptation, which is in a collaboration with the BBC, which is a British uh, TV station as well but is it is interesting to see i i can believe this i genuinely can believe this they're going to want to really capitalize or at least try to capitalize off the success of game of thrones in some way or another so yeah the long night absolutely i can see that happening it would make sense with respect to where the current season is going and how the current season is rounding out to explore it in the past would make an awful lot of sense uh, and then the other shows you know, being in script stage, yeah, I can believe it. I genuinely can. Interesting to hear that there were five, uh, but now there's only three. So I would be intrigued to hear what those others were. Bit of a shame not all of George R.R. R. Martin's uh, books work. If anyone has caught Night Flyers on Netflix, I quite enjoyed that. Shame we won't be getting a second season, as far as I'm aware. But, you know, George R.R. R. Martin, he does know how to wind a good story so i'll be looking forward to this anyway guys let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section as always if you are new here hit subscribe and stay up to date on the world of pop culture and movie news crush the bell notification icon thanks so much for watching i've missed age take care